Hey guys, what is going on? In this video, I'll be comparing the Crucial MX300 275GB M2 solid state drive to the Samsung 850 EVO 250GB M2 solid state drive. Without looking much into Samsung's VNAND technology or the Crucial's Micron 3D NAND technology, let's look at what you'll actually be getting. So starting off with the Samsung 850 EVO 250GB, we have sequential read and writes of up to 540 and 500 megabytes a second versus Crucial's 530 and 510 megabytes a second. Now let's look at the IOPS for those that don't know. IOPS means input output operations per second. On the Samsung we have up to 97,000 and 89,000 and on the Crucial we have 92,000 and 83,000. Now IOPS numbers published by manufacturers don't relate to the actual real life performance. But with that being said, the benchmark scores on the Samsung SSD is higher than that on the Crucial. But even with the slightly increased performance, is that extra money for the Samsung worth it? So the Samsung 850 EVO 250GB is currently selling for $120 on Amazon, and the Crucial MX300 275GB is currently selling for $72.99. So that is a $48 difference. But here's the catch. So on the actual Amazon listing for the Crucial, it doesn't specify whether or not it is compatible with Windows 10. But looking at the Amazon answers, I did find that it was. But, and I say but because this is what makes the difference. So according to the Amazon reviews on the Crucial MX300, some of the consumers were saying that the MX300 SSD ships out with Acronis 2015. But Acronis 2015 isn't compatible with Windows 10. And assuming that you will be using this SSD with Windows 10, you will need Acronis 2016 in order for that cloning to work. But here's the thing, Acronis 2016 is not free. However, they do offer a 30 day free trial but a lot of people have complained how the 30 day trial was limited and did not work properly. So there's that. But there are many free cloning softwares out there like Macrium. I will post a link to that in the description. And now here's where we come to the Samsung Evo 850 which states that the SSD is fully compatible with Windows 10 and pretty much works right off the bat with the appropriate cloning software that can be downloaded free. It is also stated that the SSD drive comes with a 5 year limited warranty as opposed to Crucial's 3 year limited warranty which by the way was not specified on the Amazon listing and I had to basically look that up on Crucial's website. Which pretty much brings me to my conclusion, which is, if you do value reliability, time, and an extra two years of warranty on your product, and not to mention slightly better performance, and you are willing to sacrifice that 25 gigabyte of space, since the Samsung Evo is only 250 gigabytes as compared to Crucial's 275 gigabytes, then the Samsung Evo 850 M2 SSD will be the way to go. Otherwise, if you're looking to save approximately $48 with the sacrifice of two years of warranty, making that only three years, and also having to use a third party software, slightly slower speeds but an extra 25 gigabytes of space then the crucial mx300 m2 ssd would be the way to go for you otherwise let me know in the description below which ssd you've decided upon buying and don't forget to explain why well that is going to be it for this video if you did find this video helpful give me a thumbs up because it helps me out a lot and until next time i'll catch you guys on the flip side